I'm Father Patrick Posey, the rector of the Cathedral of St. Thomas More, and today I welcome you to Two Minutes to Virtue for the beginning of our Advent season. Happy New Year. I know that might sound strange. It's December, Father, not January. But for us, it's the start of a new liturgical year. And as with the other new year, it's a time of promise and possibility. Who among us hasn't made a list of resolutions determined to start fresh on January 1st? We want that clean slate, that clean heart, that clean soul. In today's first reading, Isaiah yearns to have God with his people to return for the sake of your servants. Exiled, sinful, and seeking, the Israelites are nevertheless children of God, the work of his hands. It is through God's active participation in their lives that they are transformed as the potter transforms a piece of clay. The same can be said of us 2,000 years later. We can be transformed by events, jaded by disappointments. We can become stuck and unyielding. But if we are alert to the signs, aware of Christ's presence in our lives and the lives of others, we can experience all that this season promises, joy, hope, love, peace. My challenge to you this week is to be open to the radical and life-altering change God's grace can bring. Be the herald of Christ's birth and salvation to others. Reach out to someone who is experiencing hardship. Call a friend or a family member to tell them that you love them. I pray that this Advent brings you closer to the Lord, closer to the realization that God is ever-present and that, as Scripture says, He promises to make all things new. Thank you for listening to Two Minutes to Virtue, produced by the Catholic Diocese of Arlington. We hope this episode helped to bring this week's gospel to life and inspires you to grow in Christian virtue and love of sacred scripture today and always. To stay up to date on when Two Minutes to Virtue releases, be sure to subscribe wherever you're listening to the podcast or text 2M2V to 84576. Also, don't forget to join our public Two Minutes to Virtue Facebook group for additional content and discussion. God bless. Thank you.